News. All right, thanks to Brad. Now, with the bombings, it's such a big public event. We know a lot of you are probably wondering about security here in Milwaukee at big events like that. Yeah, like tonight's baseball game, for example. Our Henry Rossoff live outside Miller Park with a look at that and other upcoming games and festivals. Henry? And officials here at Miller Park and other big venues in the greater Milwaukee area were hesitant to talk about their security plans, and with good reason, because they're trying to keep those events secure, don't want the plans getting out. But we did learn as much as we could about Miller Park, about the Bradley Center, and many other places today. Fans seem just a little more aware of their surroundings as they pass through the Miller Park gates the day after the Boston Marathon bombings. Do I believe there should be a heightened sense of security? Yes, I do. And while a Brewers official would not tell Fox 6 if safety screening procedures are now different, we did see at least one Milwaukee police officer at every checkpoint, though fans like Dan Schrader say things seem relatively normal. Yeah, that's surprising to me. <laughs> The Milwaukee Bucks already stepped up their security months ago. They added a new screening and wanding policy at the BMO Harris Bradley Center. And stadiums aren't the only large Milwaukee gathering places considering safety after the bombings. Yeah, we can have over 100,000 people here on any given day. Securing Milwaukee's many festival grounds requires a lot of coordination as well. State Fair Police Chief Tom Strebing says guarding the fair is not nearly as complex as protecting a big, sprawling public course marathon, but he says there are different challenges. We do bag checks at the, at the various gates, but you can't, can't always find everything. Strebing says his offices go through special training to recognize potential bombs or people acting like they might plant a bomb. Again, a Miller Park spokesman would not say if similar precautions are taken at Miller Park, only saying safety is the team's highest priority. I thought there'd be a little more security. I see they were checking some bags outside a little bit, um, but uh, nothing more than usual, actually. There really is nothing like the Boston Marathon in Milwaukee or, or many other places for that matter. And for that reason, officials we spoke with said the big takeaway from the Boston Marathon situation is stay vigilant. Live near Miller Park, Henry Rossoff. Fox 6 News. All right, Henry, thank you very much. They played the theme from Cheers tonight mm, as a salute to the friends nice. in Boston out at Miller Park tonight. Fox 6 has continuing coverage of the bombings. For information anytime, go to our website, fox6now.com. Three little bodies all.